Hi, and welcome back to our channel. I'm Nina. I'm John. And we just wanted to make a different kind of video today because a lot of things are happening and let's just get you all caught up. <laughs> it has been a full year since we started to make Rag and Bone Meadery a dream come true. It's been a year since we've registered our business. Rag and Bone Meadery is an LLC and we have learned a lot. <laughs> yeah. Definitely learned a lot. Some things have taken a lot faster and some things have been extremely slow. Let's open some mead. As you know, this channel started as a commercial mead review channel. Mead haul. So even though we don't really do commercial mead reviews anymore, we still drink a lot of commercial mead. Yeah, so today we have Second City Meadery. This is a meadery out of the Second City, Chicago. So this is a blackberry, blackcurrant, cherry, and raspberry mead. And already I can smell the fruit. Yeah, the cherries are huge on the nose. It's 13% ABV. And nice. this is a, just like a little 375. The name of this is called What You're Looking For. Is it me you're looking for? I've seen this meme shared like over and over and over again. Yeah. Yeah, big fruity flavor, cherry. This is nice. Not overly alcoholic. And it's like two or three years old now at this point. <laughs> a whole pandemic has happened in between getting this and drinking it. All right, let's get into what the f is going on. <laughs> Shit, everything happens all at once, doesn't it? What, what do you got going on right now? Um, I'm in love with making videos and the Magical Mead Making series is so important to me. It's gonna be an ongoing series that we do. However, I am in the midst of expending all of my energy towards the New Jersey Renaissance Fair. And for the next two weeks, it's kind of gonna be what it's all about. So you won't be seeing any videos really from us because I am living in the Renaissance period. Plenty of mead though. Yeah. Lots of it's meat. pretty great. <laughs> and then as for me, I am going to be changing hats for my annual migration. No longer rag and bone meadery, but Alaska fish research. Dramatic hat change. <laughs> Woohoo. Yeah, I'll be going back to Alaska trying to raise money for rag and bone meadery. Because even though it's been a year that we have been a registered LLC, we don't have a license yet in the state of New Jersey. So that means we can't sell commercial mead or even make commercial mead to sit down and age. We did sort of have a vision of doing these meadery vlogs, updating you on the progress of the meadery. However, this is not a linear process. It's a lot of chaos to get whole bunch of things done and then the state will come back and tell you you have a bunch of other things to do. It's a lot of back and forth and sometimes some of these back and forth can move slower than honey on a winter's day. Let's spill some tea. <laughs> yeah, let's do it. I understand people are working from home in the pandemic, but New Jersey. <laughs> well, we were told that we were going to have a representative call us within what was it, three weeks of our application submitted. We actually let a month pass by because we thought, you know, they'll contact us. Let's not rush them. This is a lengthy process. I mean, we would like to get this done sooner rather than later, but this is a project we are endeavoring for life. <laughs> and for love, too. It is a passion project. A month goes by. The NJ ABC has not gotten in contact with us. We call them. Repeatedly. And so we finally get through to a real human. At this point, our application has been submitted with almost all the documents that we need. So we call the NJABC and we're like, hey, is someone gonna um, be assigned to us to represent us and like help us through this process? And they're like, oh sure, let me see who you've been assigned to. And they look and they're like, oh, <laughs> it's me. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, we were just sitting for a whole month and uh, our representative had no idea that they were even assigned to us. That was terrific. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We're not putting any blame on anyone for any of this because we know that things get lost and slip through the cracks. These are one of the things that we're experiencing that is making it difficult to just open a meter. But we will persevere. Remember our motto. We will not be defeated by paperwork. Say it with me. We, we will, will not be, be defeated, defeated by paperwork. paperwork. Maybe you've noticed on this channel that we have some special guests sometimes. Kendall, she's going to be helping with some mead making projects this summer again. And of course, Jeff, who you probably remember from our Penzik Apigard mead tasting video. He'll also be here. I'm happy to have them here whenever they want to play with some mead with me. That sounded strange. Yeah, it did. 
We're a family. I love to see the crazy stuff you guys come up with. Should we open the other one? Uh, yeah. Acer Glen. Yeah, this is called Blueberry Stacks, and it's a blueberry maple syrup mead. Blueberry pancakes. I'm not crazy. I'm seeing bubbles on this one too, right? Whoa! I feel like, mmm. You feel like what? Sam, you and me, sitting like this, just kind of talking. Yeah. Kind of feel like, mm. Oh, uh. <laughs> Katya and Trixie. <laughs> You're sitting where Katya sits. Yeah, you're a Katya and I'm a Trixie. I don't know, I feel like Trixie's better with money. <laughs> and the only reason money helps me sleep at night is because instead of a bed, I have just a big stack of money. Yeah, this is good. It did what it set out to do, be blueberry and maple -y. Cool. So in conclusion, John is leaving for Alaska, as he does every year. I am gonna still be making videos by myself and with Kendall and Jeff. And the friend fair has me by the balls. <laughs> In the best way possible. I asked for it and I enjoy it, so. Consent. <laughs> Consent. Key. So you want to plug your band? That's nice, yeah, I can totally do that. We are the Starcrossed Rovers! Also, uh, Jeff is in the Ren Fair. Not only in the Starcrossed Rovers, Jeff is also in the Swords and Stories fight team. And all up in the ether is Rag and Bone Meadery in its slow crawl on its way to walking and running and leaps and bounds. <laughs> I mean, now that we have a thousand subscribers. Hey! Thousand subs! <laughs> thousand subs! Way to go, you guys, for clicking that button. Uh, you did it. You made us happy. Cheers to you.